told Nick this week. Let the excitement begin. In turn, I replied, yes, please, let it, any time now, checks watch, waiting, I kid, while a lot of the goings on in Genoa City left me, understanding why its denizens need to drink so, much, coffee, a few twists actually left me, happy to be filling in for candy as your soapbox editor du jour, pour yourself a cup of terrific, performances as the effects of Sharon discontinuing her bipolar medication have taken their toll. And I was glad that Young and Restless addressed that, while Daniel may have played a role in Cassie's death, he was certainly not to blame for it. I also liked that the show didn't pretend that Google doesn't exist and had Lucy just look up her father's involvement in the tragedy. Even better was her reaction to finding out the truth, when Daniel said that no parent would be in a hurry to tell their child about something so upsetting in their past, she naturally, I enjoyed seeing Lyndon Ashby back in action as the loathsome Cameron in Sharon's mind. But the reappearance of the scene stealer, who's married to a young and restless regular in real life, mainly made me wish that the villain had been given a twin brother instead of Alan, who didn't need one to remain in the mix. Maybe the show could simply pull a days of our lives or a general hospital and have nobody notice that the new guy in town looks just like Cameron. On one hand, it served as a reminder that Case and Joshua Morrow still have it. And it suggested that when the show repairs, shick, it's going to be romantic to the north. On the other hand, why would Sharon, even in this off-kilter state, be imagining Nick telling her that she needs to fall in love again? I mean, agree, it's been years, decades in soap time. But why would matters of the heart be foremost in Sharon's mind? Perhaps I'm trying to force logic on a brain that, in its current state, can't Appler kept prattling on about how he wanted to help Chelsea and Adam, by forcing them to sit down and let him try to browbeat a confession out of them. It's obvious what Billy thinks happens. And okay, so it did happen. But if he isn't full of BS, 